Oh, I got three of them! <laughs> there! Trash all the fucking Teplosaurus so far. Hello, everybody. This is Stringy, the back for it never so the Primal Carnage Extinction. And yes, round one's about to end, and the Didos are going to win, and they did very well. Uh, you, you know what I found interesting about this round? I felt like I got swindled, because at the beginning, I got two kills. Right? You know, when I joined, I started and I got two kills. You know, they were ordinary kills like every, anyone else would get. But when I looked at the score, it said I had minus two kills. So it minus two kills from my score. I thought, hang on a minute, how does that happen? I, I know you get minus kills if you noob tube, suicide, or leave the game. I did none of that. So I don't know what happened at the beginning, but... You know, I'll, I'll put the clip, clip up real quick. See if, see if you guys see anything that I can't. a new bug in the game that the devs need to fix. But enough about that, we're about this guy that packs a set of swords. Based on the last round, I haven't seen we're going to get shredded. Well, I'm going to get shredded anyway, because I'm two of them. But we're going to have some fun and see if we get some extra kills. I had absolutely no chance of success. I attacked anyway and got a kill. 
Yeah. Uh, sorry if I don't talk much, it's because I'm concentrating. Give me a break. I'm not a woman, I can't do two things at once. Oh, this is a difficult tripod. 
got, we only got half heart now, so we're going to attack him with. Over triads. Did we win? Wow. Wow, it's actually a tie. Oh my god, that's amazing. That was really good round. Look at that. 30 kills, 15 deaths, like a boss. And if that doesn't make you want to subscribe to me, then nothing will. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. Actually, no, before we end, I, yeah, let's let's have, let's have a review of the Packy Seven Source. My thoughts, like Definitely really good, definitely good. You saw how much damage I could do. I think the drifting is a bit awkward for me. I just... I just cannot do it. So, if any of you guys have suggestions that can help me out, I'd be eternally grateful. But I think the best solution for me would be to just change the control for Crouch and just have it as, like, C, X, or Z, which would be more comfortable for me. Um, as for the double barrel one-shotting things, one-shotting the thing, I think it's okay. I think it's okay for me. I know a lot of people really don't like it and want it nerfed, but I think it's okay. I think a better solution than nerfing the weapon is just putting a class a limit on the number of pathfinders in the game. So we don't have like half a team full of pathfinders, if you get what I mean. I think limiting the number of them 
in a round at the same time is a better solution. Because I know it's all good people saying, well, don't play play around them, don't go for them, but what happens if half the team is a double barrel pathfinder? What are you supposed to do? The odds are, if you go for someone else, it's going to be one of those there. So what are you supposed to do? Are you supposed to just not attack? Like, no. But yeah, maybe a class limit would be better. But yeah, other than that, Pachycephalosaurus looks pretty good. Although I did get stuck a few times, but again, I think I could have avoided some of those deaths if I had if I had drifted properly. But again, I just can't figure it. I just can't do it. So yeah, Pachycephalosaurus looking pretty good. I mean, it would have been a big disappointment if the class didn't have any any form of muscle in it. So yeah, that's going to end this session. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe for more epic Pachycephalosaurus content in the coming days. And until then, this is Stranger Gamer signing out.